Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Connect 36 Presents The People's Cast. I am King Bear in the building. Comedian C.J. Travers. That fucking thing threw me off. Look at him. This shit, okay. I don't know what you heard about me. <laughs> On and only heavy duty. What is it? You. <laughs> What's going on, ladies and gentlemen, and my fellow, fellow constituents? We got another day and another dollar and another great show lined up for you. So, we're not going to waste time. We're going to get right into it. Make sure you hit that like, comment, and subscribe button um, because everything that you do helps us out. And we love the comments and we love watching what you decide to put on. Ugh, that sounded weird. Put on. What you decide to write in the comments. All right. I'm a little bit energetic now, so let's go ahead and get this energy going. So you guys ready? Yep. All right. Without further ado, let's get to it. And we give it back to you. The people. Today's topic is going to be about embarrassment in public. All right. Everybody let that simmer for a quick second. Embarrassment in public. All right. What would you do? Keyword do, ladies, lady and gentlemen. Keyword do. All right. Keep that in mind when you answer these questions. What would you do if a family member did something embarrassing to you in a crowded place? Okay. We, we got an understanding where we're going with this? Yeah. All right. First, first uh, scenario. Say you're out with your family and your wife, girlfriend, boyfriend, significant other picks their nose and eats the boogers and gets caught by at least 50 people doing it. And they get called out. What would you do? I'm joining in the call out. <laughs> Ew, you nasty motherfucker. I can't believe you did that. Who you came with? Who you came with? Who you came back home with? Yep. I'm calling them out too. You gonna call them out too? <laughs> You get up. You gotta get up. That's nasty. Then everybody looking at me. You don't go home. I'm not gonna go home. Somebody was sitting here eating boogers at the table. And trying to kiss him later on. Kiss baby. Man, you you on punishment for five days. Yeah, that's a long. What if they drove? I take the Uber. I take the Uber. Y'all gonna y'all gonna get the Uber over some boogers? Mm-hmm. You better hope. I didn't drive because they're still sitting at the table. So thinking about that booger they ate. <laughs> so, wow, that's nasty. Every duty awfully quiet over there. First argument would be this is what I'm talking about. You don't ever share. <laughs> Second. <laughs> Second comment be like, not bro. I'm like, that shit was nasty, bro. What the fuck? <laughs> you are stupid, man. Oh my god, you are selfish, bro. You ate the whole thing. <laughs> fuck. I even heard a crunch too. It was a crunchy one. Yeah, that shit was like the fucking filet me young. <laughs> crunchy on the outside, soft and nougat on the inside. You shit, none of that. How do you know? <laughs> you can hear it. <laughs> okay. you can, it crunched like an apple. <laughs> it was like. Oh, nah, son. It sounded like you were a booger right. eater when you were young. <laughs> you did say that. Did you say I, that your brother was on the show? Huh? Did you say that when Mel, when uh, uh, Sleep was on the show? Said what? Johnny Boogers? Hell no. Nah. Uh-uh. Yeah, you got bro, that. Mel, Mel no, no, no. 
Me, 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 me. You got that absolutely twisted. Uh uh. Now, we despise because there was kids in the neighborhood that used to do that shit. I swear I heard Bill say that, but all right. I don't. Mm-mm. You didn't hear me say it. You might have heard me bring up certain people that we all might know that might do it, but I'm say no names they, to protect the innocent. But it wasn't me. Part of the Wu Tang? Are they part of the Wu Tang clan? Uh uh-uh. uh. <laughs> okay. They might or might not have something to do with House of Bear. I'm not saying they ain't names, but. <laughs> I'm not saying that. Stop, stop, stop. Uh, 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 uh. No, no, no. Mm. <laughs> no, you say nothing else. <laughs> Did it make a me? <laughs> we ain't doing that. We ain't doing that. <laughs> stop, man. We trying to get the show. <laughs> so, okay. So. All right, so you guys are going to get up and leave the person at the table. You're going to be that you embarrassed. Kiss it, bro. Huh? You be kissing it, bro. <laughs> so we're going to move on to the next one. Okay, so what would you do, kind of the same scenario, if that same that significant other digs in their butt and smells their fingers and get caught? It's the same. I'm calling y'all like everybody else. I'm calling you out. And you better not try to hold my hand or none of that shit either. Come on, man. Hold on. Nah. You dig in it. Like, right. See, there, there gotta be levels. You gotta no, you dig going for dingleberry. Uh, nigga. Ain't no, nah, ain't no levels. Man, you got hash. That's Come on. perfect commercial. That's a perfect commercial for a day. Right there. Right. Mm. Come, come on now. All right. So say that that significant other y'all sitting at a restaurant and you don't even see them do it. They just sit there. Right. And then all of a sudden, you know, they get the little the booty itch and they're like acting like, oh, I'm so happy that we went out tonight. They, they rock it. And you think that they're doing it because they're cute and they're actually trying to scratch the booty. And then they kind of they kind of uh, they stretch and they reach back and they scratch it. Right. And then they wait a minute or two and then they go. Mm. And they do one of those real quick, but then people be like, "Man, I saw you dunking your ass." <laughs> hold, on, hold, hold on, hold on, It sounds like you are. At, no, I'm at, I'm setting up a scenario. So if that happened like that, what would you do? It could be, it could be real life, or it could not be. However, I'm not. The question is, what would you do? I'll answer it too, but what would you do? You better lie and tell me you're taking a wedgie out. You better tell me you're taking a wedgie out. You better lie to me and tell me you're taking a wedgie out. But that every nigga's always did the, the, the sneak finger chick coochie and smell, so we would automatically know what that move is. You gonna pull yes. that move off and we not see that. Because your hands was missing for a minute, all of a sudden your hands go by your nose, and never go by your nose. Like who we who we playing? That's like, true. That's that is true. that's a classic move. You don't, you don't pull out Jordan's move on Jordan. We know that move. What are you doing? So, no. Mm. You need to get called out. First thing I say, that's how COVID started. Right there. <laughs> Wash your hands. Word. Mm. Now you can't kiss or hold hands. Because you're nasty. <laughs> well, I mean, okay. But again, what if it's the situation where you didn't see it? They saw it and then they're just yelling out. So it might be a thing where maybe somebody's just pranking you. Like you have no idea. You just gonna believe random people just yelling? Yes. <laughs> You're like, yes. Uh, are, are you telling me we should smell the fingers? No. <laughs> I mean, if you really feel you need proof. If we, if we had a, an amusement park or something like that, I might use a hand as a weapon of, of mass destruction. Everybody will get some of her hand finger in their face. And then you just, just in her ass. Look at, come here. Get out the line. I want some funnel cake, nigga. Get out the line. She just does the ass. Please. You know what I, mean? I had somebody do that. What? Oh, boy. This is going to be good. I can tell. No, we was in a restaurant. And it was in a Chinese restaurant. I won't even say the one, but it was on East West Connector. I've never been back. Oh, thank God. I was hoping you wouldn't say mine, but go ahead. No, it was like a whole oh, that's, that's the Asian one right there in the corner. Right? No. East West Connector in Springs. Mm-mm, this is further down. This is like what a, um, 
Oh, you don't want to say it. Heavy duty kitchen. Let him cook, man. <laughs> Let, I want to hear the story. Well, the Starbucks is. It's right in the plaza, but. Yes. Anyway, so we sitting there, me and my sister, we go back all the time. The food was good. And I'm real funny about Chinese. So we in there, and I'm like, oh, I everybody ordering some people sitting down eating. And the door swings open. So when the door swing open, the man was digging all in his nose. And by the time it swung back, he was wiping on his shirt. Oh, man. I told that lady, I said, did you see that? And he was like, what happened? I was like, man, he was just digging at his nose and he wiped on his shirt. She was like, no, that, you know, it started talking that little language. And I was like, no, ma'am. He was digging at his nose. And this was one of the cooks or something? Yes, he was in the back. When the door swung open, I just happened to catch him. <laughs> Me and my sister was so disgusted. I was like, no, nah, I'm good. I don't even want nothing. I was like, yeah, y'all, he didn't clean. And then he didn't clean his hand. He wiped it on his clothes. Like, that lady was so mad. She went back there saying something to him. And I was like, yeah, I'm out. Because I didn't know what she was saying. But I told her, yes, he did. <laughs> he wiped everything. So, yeah, I don't. See, that's, that's right. your own fault, though, Michelle, okay? Because you ain't supposed to be peeking behind the curtain. I didn't. Peek. Let him the, cook, man. The door swung open. It was yeah, but you ain't supposed to be looking. That's that's well, that's God seasoning. Well, supposed to be doing. Thank God. She's it's supposed to be sitting different. at the table. Nah, man. You entertaining your your, your guests. You to peek behind door number one, nigga. You peek. Like, no, not not at a Chinese food restaurant. You know it's dirty it's stuff going right. on back there. Yeah. That, I wanna know how dirty. It's like you'll never eat Chinese. So openly, like he didn't even think about the door swinging open <laughs> or nothing. This, I, it's high back there. They they got eight watts yeah, going all at the once. Back door open. You didn't have to do that. It had nothing to do with you know, <laughs> digging in your nose and then wiping, and then you finna fix it. Nah, I never get back. That was in 15 years. That's how you get the extra pal in the compound. The, the people were saying, <laughs> because they showed in there, they food, so I let them have it. But, you know, that's, that's you should have called the health inspector to make an anonymous call. See, that's come on. I got to question your New York card on that one. Come on, man. Yeah, look. Every time I heard about American Deli down the street from my old job, they was cooking niggas food and putting the rice bowl and shit over the garbage position. That shit even got world star and got viral. I was going there. I just went there two days prior. I wanted to go in the bathroom and act like America's top model and vomit in the toilet. You know what I'm saying? I was in my ah. I was in there trying to make myself vomit. So, I, I like I say all the time on the stage, I like the mystery of not knowing what's going on. The moment I know what's going on, there's a problem. Like, I don't want a Chinese restaurant that get grocery, get a damn a delivery truck come up to the damn thing. I want the mystery. But, but you, I, know, I know the mystery. But you from, from New York, you know. Mm -mm. You I, know. I, we allude to what we know. We all speculate. It's, I don't want to really see you chopping a cat, nigga. But you know it. All right, you know for a fact your neighborhood be overrun with rats and cats. Chinese food moves in, no more rats and cats after a month. We know this. This is a New York way of life. We know this. Yeah. It's different when you see it chopped. Uh, <laughs> yeah, but by then you've been eating it for like six months or a year. So you gonna stop eating after you find out? We all know we have females that fuck with other dudes before us. It's different when you catch the motherfucker doing it. You're like, ah, <laughs> shit's different now. I caught you. No I see you doing it. Uh, okay. Damn, all this from the digging in the butt and smelling fingers, yeah. boy. We, <laughs> Jeez. Yes. Okay. All right. Say um, that same, that significant other said something incredibly incorrect. And they proceed to defend it to other people with their life. Like, you know they're wrong. The other people know they're dead wrong. And they're, like, going down to the ropes with it. They're like, you can't tell them that they're completely and utterly wrong. What would you do? Like, they're embarrassing you by showing how stupid they are. <laughs> I can't think of a better word, but they, they, they're being stupid right now. What would you do? Yeah, tell them to shut the fuck up. Like, just shut up. You're making me look bad. You're making us look bad. Shut up. Stop. And then they start getting loud. You're making us look bad by you keep thinking you're right with the rest of these morons. Why can't you see that this is how it is? 
and they get in loud and belligerent with you. I'm out. <laughs> I, don't do, I don't do the yelling. I don't do, I don't do in front of people. I'm right, you. right. You can't embarrass I'm me. I'm, I'm now I'm gonna, now I gotta bust your bubble and I gotta break you down. Cause other niggas gonna do it. I have this platform to do it. And I like audience because I do shit in the audience. So you wanna be loud, let's be loud. Now I gotta break your shit down. Cause I was gonna let you live and they say you shut up. But now I gotta fucking really tell you why you shit wrong. Okay, and now remember, you being a male, you're going against a woman. So you're trying to get loud with emotions, which means that will take it to a whole new level of loud with the chance of flipping on you. Okay. You talking some high class shit right now, like, Okay. Again, I don't, I don't mind the fucking thing. You want to embarrass us, get embarrassed. I've done this before, is what I'm saying. So it is what it is. So y'all just gonna have a show now because, like I said, she's defending it with her life. I'm trying. I'm trying to shut you down real calmly, real cool. Probably put my hand on your shoulder on your hand, like yo, chill, relax. And she you just, she just ramping it up. And she does that Denzel unhand me, Negro. Or she yeah. choke right. you up real quick. Word. Yeah. <laughs> she's like, if you put your hand on me one more time mm-hmm. while I'm trying to tell these idiots how wrong mm-hmm. they are, mm-hmm. you need to have my back on this. You're supposed to be my man. I'm gonna have one more time of me putting you to the side. This is my second warning. Stay fire. And then and when she don't get it at that point, then nah, nah, I gotta go. Cause I'm like, you, you fucking with me crazy. That's not it. So you gotta go. What do you mean? I said then I gotta go in. Now I, now I'm, I'm my second time I'm gonna be trying to pull you to the side like all right, yo, you cut it out. Mm-hmm. You're dead ass wrong. I'm not gonna tell you dead ass wrong because women don't like to be told they dead wrong in front of everybody. Yeah, I love to come to each other's defense and shit for that type of shit. Somebody, oh, you chill. You're doing too much right now. Now, you know a hurt woman is going to come at you low blowing. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> okay. So now if you out there ain't got nothing to do with nothing, and it might not even be true, but all of a sudden she hits you with a, get off me, you little dick motherfucker, like loud as shit. Where are you going with it? Yeah, I will. You <laughs> 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 Uh, I got a little dick, you got a stink pussy. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Your fucking cook, your pussy lips is mangled. You feel like hobbies. Like, what, what you, go you just gonna, you just gonna <laughs> go down to the gutters too, huh? I'm just gonna keep and revving it up. So how far do you wanna go? Let's go to hell. I got an express ticket, bitch. Let's go. You wanna go? <laughs> oh, man. Hey. I'm also in arguments anyway. Anybody who knows me knows. I'm a total, complete asshole. I, I revel in those moments. Combatively, oh yeah, let's go. So I'm telling you, stand down. All right. We can go, we can go head to head, it's all good. All right, so we got Michelle K up and leaving because she ain't dealing with the yelling. We got CJ Trowers out here wanting to smoke. Heavy duty, you're the tiebreaker. What you gonna do, brother? I am with Michelle. <laughs> I am gonna... I don't do nonsense in public. Uh-huh. You're not going to yell at me. I'm not going to yell back. You're not going to embarrass me any further. I'm going to get up and walk away and go to the car. I'm out. And if she's, if it's her car? I take an Uber. No, no fucking deal. No, mm. no problem. Uh, I don't I don't deal with that ghetto attitude. That's why I left New York. York. They're going to yell my man. You the one with the bitch talking about the, the, the planet's flat. <laughs> <laughs> Word. It's one of them type of things. Uh-huh. <laughs> and she out there insulting people in there. These idiots out here think the, the world is round. Yeah. Fucking morons. <laughs> and you like, babe, you, you you wrong on this one, man. You need to sit down for real. You, you just as dumb as the rest of these stupid motherfucking. Uh, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Some shit like, there ain't no H2O water. <laughs> <laughs> Sit your stupid ass. <laughs> I swear to God. <laughs> That's the type of person who will buy dehydrated water. <laughs> <laughs> buy smart water and shit. Oh my God. Yeah, I'd be apologizing to people with the play. I'm like, I'm sorry, man. She's stupid. Like, whatever argument I gotta have at home, I'm just gonna have to have at home. I'm like, hey, I'm sorry, she's stupid. Is she? Yeah. <laughs> I'm just standing at the door. I promise you, I'm unloading everything. Everything, right? You ain't gonna let him have it in the car. You just gonna wait to the, wait to we you get to the house. We're not even driving together. I said I already left. So you gotta find a ride home. So when you get to the house, 
I promise you. You might as well don't even come to the house. I promise you. I'm gonna be mad. You embarrassed me. Mm-hmm. Are you talking to that <laughs> yeah, my feelings. You tell us about pride. Yeah, uh, that's when I really, that's when I really show my ass. Now, let me ask you: Are you going to get on him for embarrassing you, or are you going to get on him for being wrong? Both. For both. <laughs> <laughs> like, have you defended stupid shit? What I look like? I'm sitting so over here looking like you like. What the hell are you talking about? You ain't it right, baby? Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> what the hell are you agreeing to that dumb shit? Like, no, don't do it. Don't do it. Mm-mm. We're not gonna be. You gotta hit him with a fucking science textbook. Yeah, something. I'm like, read fucking the fucking textbook and call me afterwards. <laughs> be yelling for for Siri and Google. Yeah, like, like, no. Figure that one out real quick. Be like, my G, you couldn't look that up before you started this bullshit. I'm gonna be rethinking my. <laughs> like, what in the world did I do? Like, yeah, like, my uh, like Michelle's that. gonna be like, man, is this dick good enough to fucking do <laughs> further? Right, exactly. I'll be like, yeah, no, it's not worth it. He do, he do do that thing with his tongue. No. See, he be lying, but that goddamn tongue. I'm like, that's just <laughs> like, that's why, why it's so good? Cause he likes so good. <laughs> no. But remember, he's not lying. He's just dumb. He believes. Remember, with his life, so he believes that. That's even scarier. Yeah. So, yeah. No. She had that dick. <laughs> I don't want it. It won't even be negotiable. Like, no, I have to sit here and look at you every day and just thinking about the stuff that you just said before. <laughs> like, no. Boy, you dumb. Yeah, and everybody like, are you still with that dumb joke? <laughs> Good. Yeah. Like, girl, you know, I seen the video, right? That shit was all on. That shit was on Instagram. It was on TikTok and YouTube. Yeah. Yeah. This thing was standing on the table declaring that the world was flat and everybody else was morons for believing it was round. No proof that the world was was round. Woo. Had a full argument talking about why do you think when planes take off, they go in a straight line? They don't go in a circle. <laughs> and you in a restaurant like, what the f- <laughs> What the Happy fuck Colin, is- Happy Colin Ridge view. <laughs> so, somebody Come get him. Yeah, Come somebody, get him. Somebody losing it, so no. Come yeah, get him and bring the, bring the jacket with the straps. <laughs> and the van it's with like the pillows got- on the wall. <laughs> It sounds like he got straight A's from the ESL classes. Oh, yo. <laughs> he got to go. Okay. <clears throat> All right. So, uh, next one. All right. Say they. Ooh. Okay. Say they, the same significant other, gets loud with you in public in an argument and declare you and your mother ain't crap. You and your mama ain't shit. Words like that don't bother me because they say your mama ain't shit. And that's it. Okay, well. You didn't hear the first part. Get loud with you in an argument. Mm hmm. I, mean, I, <laughs> I would just throw those words back in. Okay, my mama ain't shit. So what? <laughs> so that's not going to. What's that going to make me do? Cry? No. I mean, my mama is somebody. So I'm not. Words like that don't. It just depends on how you come at me on certain stuff, but nah, that don't bother me. I got okay. bigger words and just stuff like that. So. Okay. Mm-mm. All right. So them getting loud and doing it in a in a restaurant or an environment where other people are looking at you while he's yelling this at you, that's not gonna bother you. It don't bother me. Like I said, I will get up <laughs> once again, but I'm not gonna be like, oh, my mama ain't shit. I mean, you might hear this later, man. You you gonna get it later. Yeah, that's that's all I can say. It's not in front of public though. All right, just to reaffirm, heavy duty bag. I know where, you, where you're gonna go with it, but go ahead. Again, I'm not gonna argue with you, but I'm gonna tell my mama. I say, mama, are you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that little Latin lady. I'm gonna tell like, my mama, are you? <laughs> She's going to come after your ass, and that's between you and her. Because she's going to cut you. She's from the old school with the razor blade in your mouth from New York. Oh, she's going to... Oh, shoot. <laughs> the she blowing cut. <laughs> <laughs> Two motions. <laughs> you done. Okay. CJ. 
Copy and paste from the last answer. <laughs> Man, like, you you gonna be down there for the smoke, huh? And double down on telling the mom Dukes what she said, because I'm gonna tell her while I'm walking to the car. <laughs> Let me, mom, let me tell you what this mother is from this I really do defend. You know I am, but you can double. You can call her right now. She's still in the park. <laughs> Put her in speakerphone. I'm telling you. Oh man. Yeah, I'm. I in that scenario, I'm probably going to make it my, my, my job, my quest to make her leave. Because now I'm just like, okay, now we in it to see. Who, who's going to break? Like, now I see a challenge. Because you do that, now we throw it. Like, I really am going to go down in the gutters. Because I want you to get so embarrassed that you get up and leave. But the first thing I'm going to do is hit my pocket to make sure my keys are in my pocket. And it's my car that's outside. <laughs> and be like, yeah, I'm secure. Let's rock. <laughs> Let's rock. You can Uber or you what? Because now I'm going to be in this restaurant and I'm going to go the hell off. And they either going to throw us both out or they're going to look like, I can't believe she actually started with him and he went nuclear. Yep. That That's going to be my goal. You're going to You got to go nuclear. The only way to shut down a fucking somebody, you got you to gotta go. You got to up the ante. You so got to. Again. I got to agree with that one. <laughs> You gotta if show them so. If you back down, every time that shit happens, they're gonna feel you back down, you're gonna walk away. To cut the head off a snake, you gotta cut the fucking head off a snake. I That's agree. Snake. You want to make a scene, no. let's make a scene. I agree. No, you can walk away from the relationship. That's where you walk away. Yeah, but before I go, let me leave you with this nugget. <coughs> Come on, on. yeah. Y'all can't be giving up on love like that. Sometimes frustration and emotions will have you do crazy <laughs> shit, man. Nah. I left that ghetto shit in New York, bro. I've been out of New York since 2005. Fuck that shit, bro. You know, yeah, but, okay. like that. Okay, oh, time to dirty it up based on that. Okay, so say you're with somebody for 10 years. You know, you got one or two kids with the person. Y'all been together this amount of time. And then something traumatic happens in their family. So they going through shit. And you know they going through shit. And then they just pick this night. Everything work, that situation, and then something with the kids all comes to a culmination and it just explodes right there into something that you're perfectly fine when it starts it turns into something stupid in your head but they have so many things on their plate you're just catching all hell based on that so now you're going to tell me based on that you're going to say you know what fuck this whole relationship because you had one really bad off night i don't know man but see that and that that's what i'm saying <clears throat> well if you walk away just like cj said if you walk away how you know it don't happen again <laughs> you know that's how battered men and battered women get out here you know they get punched in the face and then when they go home baby i'm so sorry i didn't mean to i'll, I'll go to therapy i'll do whatever it takes and then a month later punch you in your face again. Bam, I'm, I'm so sorry. I, I, it'll never happen again. And now all of a sudden, they're getting their ass whooped every Sunday. <laughs> I shot a pump fake. Bitch, you should have ducked. Bitch, who don't, who, don't, who don't dip back like this when I'm doing, nigga doing that shit? So, I mean, what do you do in that situation? Are you really going to walk away from, you know, 10 years and kids? Because they had a really, really bad night. And it happens. Especially if you know that's not their character. You see what I'm saying? Listen, I don't feel, uh, I personally don't feel comfortable talking about this anymore because I'm not trying to testify for CJ in court. You know what I mean? Do, do not cook. <laughs> I don't like going to court. Come on, but we talk about you though. What about me? You, you, I'm going to walk away. I'm gonna walk away. She's probably gonna follow me. First of all, you better get my steak from the plate and put it in your purse. And take it with you, Cause that shit was good. You know what I mean? I, I, I would really be pissed off because I've been waiting 30 minutes for my damn medium rare steak and shit. And mm. you're gonna act up like this? Oh no, you better put it in the, in the fucking napkin, put it in your purse. And that shows me how much you love me. Cause you're, you're gonna eat some, me off. I'm trying to embarrass some me. Some lengthy steak. Hungry, and now I'm hungry. Fuck that shit. 
<laughs> he was serious. That, that's going to be the apology, a lengthy cold state. <laughs> right. I got a man. Uh, yeah, yeah. all on it, you yeah, nasty. Yeah. I don't give a fuck. As long as I didn't have to pay for it, I'm okay with it. All of y'all had the argument. He's a scumbag. That's right. But can I walked away from it. That's right. But then we're gonna have that argument in the car. I'll tell you that. Don't you ever embarrass me like that again. Oh, so you're gonna stick around? Time. First and last time. Did this ever happen again? You gotta get this stage. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, I'm driving. I'm, I'm driving. I'm driving like he ended up ripping like, the stage. <laughs> you know what I mean? Watch that style on her. And I'm getting, I'm, I'm getting even more pissed off because the steak is cold now. I'm like, ah, oh, the butter is not even melting no more. I'm like, uh huh. The fat done. Oh, yeah, the fat got hard and, and waxy. It got that brown yeah. fat on top of it. I don't, See, now you're going to really be pissed off because I'm going to put the heat on in the summertime so my fucking steak could get nice and warm. <laughs> Fuck you, bitch. Fuck you. And now I we're back to the tit, tit sweat. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He's trying to rap. Now you got to smell my tit sweat, bitch. That's it. <laughs> Go get me a towel. <laughs> wow. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Write that down, Michelle, so you don't forget. <laughs> He's so stupid. Man. I remember that. Okay. Thank, thank, thank. Okay. okay. So we're gonna lighten it up a little bit. Okay. Say that your significant other fucking with my stick. I'm sorry. <laughs> in public, start singing loudly, but they can't sing, and they call out your whole name while doing it. They are not drunk. Like a, like, like a love song or some shit? Yeah. Love song or, you know, a thought rap song and they put your name in it. Like sexy red type shit? Yeah. Oh, nah. Like a call or or they throw in they, they throw in the 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 wop, the wop and they put the your wop. name in the middle of the song. They be like, comedian CJ Charles want this wet ass. <laughs> now, now, I, now I walk away. I would do like that. I don't know this one. Um, excuse me, I get my special need cousin out. This motherfucker's having a, a Tourette's moment. I'm out of here. Come on, CJ. She's a brown sister with big ass titties. Uh -huh. she, why, you gotta be doing, why you gotta be doing all that? <laughs> she can't sing, but she got like the big. Uh huh. Like you love yeah, she a midget with big like things on the dragon yeah. ground, and she ain't nothing yep. but like. Four one or 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 three eleven, and she dark skin chocolate, and she got the midget wobble and shit, but she got the big old like big old bazoongas. Yep, with big nipples bigger than your thumb. And she she talk about <laughs> and she's sitting there with the midget bow leggedness, and she's like, comedian CJ Charles, what this wet ass was it? <laughs> I gotta pick, I gotta pick up from the back of her shirt and sit on my lap. <laughs> Let Come on, bitch. Like she luggage. Come on, bitch. <laughs> Get your ass over here and stop playing with me. I got whisper. Yeah, stop fucking embarrassing me in front of me. Okay? What the shit? If I throw you on my goddamn shoulder, what got to do? Okay? <laughs> Act right. This one won't take you nowhere. Act right. Put your fucking chair and swing your legs like you're <laughs> All right, all right, let me ask you a quick question. <laughs> so instead of singing, cause you get embarrassed of singing, what if she just stands up and start clapping her cheeks so everyone can hear the clap? <laughs> <laughs> and she a midget, so it sound like this. Now, nah, come on, <laughs> this is enough now. It's show now. <laughs> nah, nah. <laughs> she's, trying, she's trying to beat pop with her cheeks. <laughs> Trying to beep up, bro. What you gonna do? Oh my god! Oh, you're retarded. What you gonna do, son? You're retarded. <laughs> so now I gotta give her wedgie and walk out <laughs> her by her underwear. Out the fucking. She don't got underwear on. She huh? trying to make it clap. Like she luggage for I real. Have her pants on. And she's getting picked up and she walking out. I'm walking out. You was walking her down the street oh, like she a fucking tote bag. <laughs> Don't worry about it. I got her. God got dang, her. she embarrassing. Bring your little big titty ass on. Right. Oh, oh my God. Dog carrying bags and shit. But <laughs> get inside. Get inside. Get inside.
Heavy Duty, what would you do? She starts singing loudly and put your name in the middle of the song. That's Heavy fine. Duty Cutie, what this wet ass? <laughs> Loud as shit. <laughs> and people oh. turning around. <laughs> you be dancing with her shit? <laughs> Fuck it. Because <laughs> I know I'm going to get it. <laughs> I'm not dating her for her voice. <laughs> <laughs> Word, especially if she's singing it in Spanish. Oh. <laughs> Call me Poppy once. It's Oba. <laughs> He's a scumbag. It's Oba song. <laughs> Come on, you. Tell him, Heavy. Silly. Oh, shit. What would Michelle, you do? Michelle, 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 Michelle K. K. I would just. I would sit there and just laugh and like, will you please stop? <laughs> just so, I don't know. I don't know if I get up and walk out, but I know I'll be embarrassed. But. What if he, he starts? Had to, if he has to turn off the lights and have the spotlight on you while he's singing it. Oh, my. And remember, he can't sing. So he voice cracking and everything. He ain't. He's sing, he, he sing a love ballad. Yeah, that is horrible. And he, he hit the Jeff. But see, women think that's, that's kind of cute. I'm I'm you see, she thinks that's kind of cute. But I was still being bad. Like, yeah, gotta finish. Uh, yeah. You just run over and kiss him so he can't sing no more. Like, mm -hmm. like okay. He's listen. coming out with a Brian McKnight song in the middle of the stage mm -hmm. and pointing yeah. straight at you with the spotlight pointing straight at you. <laughs> He's doing his his greatest moves and shit. <laughs> <laughs> He's doing all that shit. I told you, I don't do well being in marriage. <laughs> I don't know. I would just be. You ain't gonna walk out and leave no, him up there and sing it though, right? No, I won't do that then, but I'll be laughing. But I'll be just like, please stop. Just. Uh, what are, if, you, are, you gonna, are you gonna give him the wop afterwards or no? Yeah, because I'll be like, shit, don't yeah. do that no more though. Come on. But yeah, don't do that. Don't, you don't have your fingers that shit in the parking lot. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. But I'm not for, don't embarrass me. Okay, so what if he starts singing the derogatory song? Like if he goes, Michelle K, there's some hoes in this house. <laughs> he starts saying some bullshit. Yeah, I don't. <laughs> he starts singing some bad shit. Yeah, I, I'm gonna walk out, but if he don't stop, then I'm like, well, I'm leaving. Don't do that. That's embarrassing. Right. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's what the topic's about, being embarrassed. Like looking at you and stuff. Real like, talk. What she gonna do? No, don't do that. <laughs> you say you say I can't sing to you is that the brown sugar song? You can brown sing sugar baby. Yeah, that song stop don't come out and call me no bitches and hoes and you don't do that. <laughs> you know, just What are you do that? I can't stand you. Man. The first two verses from Juvenile back that anger. <laughs> nah, do, do the brown. Y'all making it easy for it. Oh, nah, nah, to two thousand. You 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 dropping like a pop? Drop, 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 drop it like that. What if he's singing wow. Cisco and DMX talking about what these bitches want from a nigga? <laughs> Put your name in there. I got Michelle, 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 Michelle. <laughs> <laughs> he said your name 75 times. <laughs> I don't no, this don't, I don't know. It's definitely hard to explain. I don't know. Michelle, 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 Want at least one Keisha? <laughs> <laughs> About 27 Michelle Keys. <laughs> I would be, yeah, I would be embarrassed. That was. Okay. What about you, Bear? I'm out of there, dog. Beep, beep. I'm out of there so fast. <laughs> Bruh, I get embarrassed in my house when the wife and the kids start singing. Like, it's cringeworthy in a house. I can't stand it. It's like nails on a chalkboard to me. I'm like, please stop. And then they do that. What's that thing called? Um, uh, What is it? Not falsetto. That thing where they chop up their voice while they're in the middle of singing. Like that, uh, 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 that bullshit that uh, people do when they auto sing. Auto-tune shit. Yeah, not auto-tune, but it's a, um, it's a style of singing. Like when you hold a long note, Instead of just holding it in one steady uh, note, black people like to make it waver while they're singing in the middle of it. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Like when they're in church. That drives me 
crazy. And not the good crazy either. That drives me literally mental. Like, I hate it. I hate it. I, every time they do it, I look at them, and I'm like, you know they ain't doing that in the song. Why Why are you doing that? Like, please stop. Remix. Like, stop doing Don't do that. And it drives me crazy. So if they do it in public, I'll just get up and walk the fuck off. And now you put my name in it? Now that's my pet peeve. If you say my name in public louder than just a regular conversation, I will walk the fuck off. I will walk the fuck off. That is one thing that would like. I can't even be in a in a in a restaurant in a shopping shopping uh what do you call it like a, a grocery shopping store or anywhere like that. You know when you're trying to get attention of somebody who's like down the other aisle. Don't don't you do it. Don't you don't don't you yell my name across the motherfucking aisle. Don't you do it. I literally have gotten in trouble from my dad when I was younger because my dad has a loud, boisterous voice. And this is, he, <clears throat> he would do that shit all the time. He would literally see me on the other side of the aisle and yell my government. But, <laughs> loud as shit, I'm like, I will turn and walk the fuck off. No one he heard, hey, you heard me. I, mm -hmm. I guess I'm just gonna take the thumb to the forehead when we get the car. Fuck that. You done fucked up now. I ain't <laughs> do. I, I I got something about that. I don't yell my name. Don't do it. I I, I it, that's a pet peeve of mine. So you get to sing in my name all loud in in public. I'm gonna walk the fuck off every time. One hundred percent. Even if the whole crowd is like, oh, that was sweet. Pan the camera. Let's see who she talking to. It's gonna be an empty seat because I'm gone. <laughs> I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm be. I'm be in the car. <laughs> I'm, yeah, everybody already know. Don't do that. Uh. Uh. I can't take it, man. That I have no tolerance for that. So that's my thing. Okay. Everybody answered, right? Okay. Here we go. If that significant other grabs the crotch or chest of a random person while holding your hand. And they're not drunk. Say that one more time. Your significant other, say y'all, <clears throat> say y'all are at a, a, not really a concert, but like you know, like the little what they call them that we go to, like the music fest, you know. And y'all are sitting, y'all, like yeah, yeah, something like Piedmont, something like that, or yeah. And y'all happen to be on your way to where you're gonna sit down, and there's a whole group of people out there. And then your significant other sees sees a uh, comedian sit, cinnamon buns trousers walk by, and he got on the gray sweatpants, and he got he got he, yeah, and he he got the cinnamon buns all out for the public, and she walks up and she's like ooh, and she walks up and she grabs a whole handful of the luscious cinnamon buns. She just grab just ooh, and she's like I'm she's like I'm so sorry, man. I just had to get a squeeze. Did you see how they were sitting up like that? While she holding your hand, what do you do? She got big titties. <laughs> I mean, that, she that, your that, girl, so yeah. If that's your girl, then yeah. All right, CJ, what you got? No, he talking. No, about you, that. you first. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so focused on CJ. I'm in a scenario, I, nigga. How am I gonna do with me, <laughs> bro? I seen worse from you. Um, uh, although I hate it, I might have to pause that one. <laughs> like, wait a minute, what are we talking about here? You know what? Never mind. I don't want to know what you're talking about. Y'all keep that. Y'all keep that remote wherever y'all at. It kind of looks like y'all in the same place with the yellow walls. So I don't know. <laughs> My walls are yellow. Yeah. Yeah, right. You should be lucky. You got a window, son. I do. Uh, what do you, What are you doing, heavy duty? All right, so I'm holding my, you say my lady's hand. Right, right. and y'all are walking, getting ready to go sit down somewhere, and the person in front of you got the cheeks all out, and she can't okay. help herself. She's just like, you know what? He's just gonna get mad. And she just reaches out and she just grabs a whole handful of cheek. Of my girl's cheeks? No, your girl grabs the dude in front of her cheeks. 
it's just very confusing because that wouldn't be my girl <laughs> anymore. anymore. <laughs> right. She probably get the elbow. <laughs> but she can't say I hit her with my fist. <laughs> You know what I mean? Because I, you know, I probably just say, "Oh my goodness!" And I just hit it with the elbow by mistake. Oh my how? God. So, how? How could you do that? We talk. How physically? How? Like if she's holding your your left hand and you got her right hand, and she reaches out with her left hand and she grabs wait, wait, cheek. Wait, 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 wait. She, she, I'm holding her left hand. She's holding my right hand. You just said no. That? She's hold. Yeah, she's holding your left hand with her right hand. So y'all are walking straight forward. That makes no sense. My left hand, it gotta be. Think about that. Okay, so she's on my okay now we see which one would be standing up talking about flat earth, aren't we? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> What's that? What, what y'all walking backwards? Like we, <laughs> her right hand, her right hand would be in your left hand if y'all are walking the same direction. You, okay. you with me? Okay, now I got it. Okay, I don't know how you now got it. That's the exact same thing I said, but all right, we got it. Okay, she takes her left hand and she reaches out to the guy in front of you guys and grabs his cheeks. So you only have the right hand. Yeah, you only have the, you have her right hand with your left hand. So you're walking and do you see her left hand reach out and grab his cheeks? He turns around, looks at her and he kind of smirks. He's like, <laughs> And he looks at you, he goes, hey, what's up? And then he just turns around and keeps on walking by his business. A question I have for you. Mm -hmm. How big is this dude? All right, originally it was CJ Cinnabon's trousers, but we ain't gonna go there. So oh. we'll just say, we'll just say he's six one-ish, you know, and he got, he got firm, you know, bodybuilder cheeks. Like he, he a swole muscle dude. <laughs> <laughs> I'll probably come out. Look at CJ face. <laughs> <laughs> CJ Cam. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I'm just saying. Chess is He's swollen. You know what I mean? And little old me. I'm going to come out mad upset at Shorty afterwards. Right. But for me to defend my honor and my body from harm, I'm going to be like, hey. <laughs> hey. <laughs> uh -uh. I'm trying to get home alive. <laughs> but then I'm going to be pissed off at Shorty. Oh, my God. <laughs> Uh, fantastic answer, too. Uh, that shit was fantastic. Say, like, ooh, girl. Yeah. <laughs> you must have walked oh, out man. today. Oh, that would not even be funny. Ooh, shit. Mm. And this is the A, so he probably look around and be like, <laughs> he probably like, yeah, this is the land. I can't even get back. <laughs> Are there some holes in this house? <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, Michelle K, we're going to go to you on this one. If your, yeah, if your man reached out and grabbed the girl's cheeks in front of you, and he was like, man, I'm sorry, I, I had to. Did you see it? No. He can't say nothing? <laughs> he just got to grab it and say nothing? What? Well, would you be able to don't say sorry? Don't say sorry. You, you, you can't say those words. You, you say would you rather he say nothing? He just do it and act like he do it? Just give me the dumbest look you got. <laughs> I'm gonna give you the dumbest look too. Like, really? You just you got I'm gonna snatch my hand back. It's gonna be like, what? <laughs> I'm, I'm definitely walking off saying some words, and you better not grab me or follow me. Mm. There we go. <laughs> and that's it. That's it. Whole day ruined. Whole, it's gonna be ruined. It's right. <laughs> that's disrespectful. That's like, oh, it's very disrespectful. Yeah, you did it in my face. Uh -huh. Not like you try to be discreet about it. You just right. But what if it was that amazing? It was. It could have been. It might have been a nice ass. Right. Right. But wait until I walked off. 
do it when I wasn't paying attention or something, but don't do it in directly in my face. That's just like you didn't give a bit on how I was gonna feel. What I was but he was holding your hand. You weren't gonna walk off. <laughs> he didn't know it was gonna happen. Yeah, you didn't. Standing in front of you, and he see it. Yeah, he knows it's gonna happen. So yeah. But he he was the whole time he sweat this. He's like, oh my god, he fighting it for like a quarter mile. She walking in front of him, and she's just boof 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 just in front of him. Something else, but don't do that. Mm. Right, but we're not talking about don't do. We're talking about what you would do. So you just say you're just gonna walk off. Yeah, we walk off mad. I'm throw my hand back and like, don't you follow me? <laughs> back there. He gonna be a bitch and everything. Gonna be everything. Yeah, yeah, it's gonna be. It's, it's no safe word at that point. Right. So yeah, I'm walking off, and then you come and follow me and grab me. Yeah, that's that's what I'm talking about. Your family, then they gonna, <laughs> yeah, they gonna die. Your kids, your mama. Damn. Because I'm mad now, and right. you disrespect me, so you disrespect is out the door at that point. So I'm going for uh-huh. juggling. And you did it in my face. Yeah, mm-hmm. I don't have no sympathy. Wow. <laughs> All right, CJ, what are we doing, bro? It's the same muscular dude. <laughs> <laughs> Same, same muscular cheeks is out, dog. So and you can tell he got a bodybuilder thong underneath the gray sweat. Oh so my first reaction when we look at her, and I'm gonna go, bitch. And, 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 and so I hit her in the, when I hit her in the temple, she gonna pass out. And I said, my man, my bad, dog. She got, a, she had a seizure. I think her hand kind of stuck her like this. I might have hit you by accident on the way down. You good, though? I got this. Let's go with this one day, nigga. Get oh, ahead and go man. And, and if he turn around, I'd be like, yo, man, why you hit her like that? You ain't supposed to be out here hitting women. Now he ready to square hey, up. Hey, nigga, you got a temple too, nigga. <laughs> now, I said back away. Okay? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> you just gonna be out there fighting everybody. <laughs> Let me tend to a seizure, nigga. <laughs> I apologize like a man. Go ahead. Talk about go ahead. Talk. You gonna you gonna elbow smash her in the in the temple? <laughs> they all fold like a chair in the temple. Boy, you brutal, man. Right. Wait a minute. So what? Right. That's what she said. I won't do it again. Okay. <laughs> yeah, she ain't gonna be doing much. Except being a fucking zucchini, you gonna make it to a vegetable. And what what my fair word? What did we learn? <laughs> she ain't gonna learn nothing. She gonna be sitting there drooling to my la la la. You risk you risk your life for a grab. See what I'm saying? See what That's the story you gotta tell. Yep. Hey, why you missing three teeth in the front of your mouth? <laughs> you gonna go to jail over a booty squeeze, nigga? Attempted murder over a booty squeeze. It's her against mine. She can't remember nothing. That temple, the temple, the hell of a book. <laughs> well, obviously the dude will. He'd be like, yeah, she reached out, she grabbed these luscious cheeks, and he elbow smashed her. Huh? He won't know. He was his back was towards me. He don't know what happened. In his mind, she fell, like I said, and she had a seizure. Okay, so you're going to wait till. All right, so she squeezes, she pulls back. He turns around, looks. No, she I mean, by the time she before she even pulled back, that's the bitch. No. <laughs> <laughs> so exactly. So he already gonna be turned around like you know, who just know, grabbed my cheeks? Her hand, her hand gonna be like this in position. <laughs> <laughs> so it's believable. She had a seizure. My hands are stuck with Wait a minute, so you gonna be in Ryu position. You gonna be like the <laughs> Yuki. Dude, you you at the music festival, so there's like people all around you. So somebody see that gym. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Boy, you go to jail over a booty squeeze, dog. Got it on hey, look, all I gotta do is say, Y'all saw me try to raise, put my arm around it. That's it. I try to put my arm around her, and she passed out. It's like, dude, her whole skull collapsed over you raising her arm. All right, then, Dragonfly Jones. Like, what's the. <laughs> 
Oh, oh my God. God. I'm not trying to kill him. I'm just trying to give him a little tap. Bro, bro they're going to keep using these videos against you in the court of law, bro. <laughs> they're going to line up. Every video that gets brought forward is going to be another count. Of attempted murder. <laughs> Change your name to violent comedian, bro. God, no. Lord have mercy. Okay, so flip around. Same, same scenario, <clears throat> but instead of cheeks grabbing crotch, like the the well, person's coming myself. towards y'all, and I'm she's gonna, just gonna, like she me. see, and the the meat's like an elephant trunk. It's just it's swinging back and forth as he's walking, and she's just like, fuck it, whatever he do, he's just gonna have to do. And she just reach out and grab the old saucy. She's like, I just got to see if it's real. See if it's real? Yeah. What? Sometimes y'all be having socks and stuff like that. So you, yeah, you sometimes y'all y'all be having socks so and just... Y'all. I don't, you, I don't know. Now I know you. But I'm fuck that. that. That's what you be doing? Well, not me. Like I said, man, I got what I got. And that's what I got. <laughs> I don't think shit. No. I don't know. You out here Donald Trump in it. This is grab by, <laughs> grab by, walk by the set. Right here. No. So what would you do though? Reverse order, CJ. She reach out and she, she grab the old sausage. Or this dude just walking by. He walking down the way and she just reach out and just grab me. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna play the politically correct card saying, "Well, young thug my ass," because y'all niggas typecast me. So I'm just gonna walk away. I'm, just, I'm gonna say walk away. This. Nobody in this fucking podcast believe that shit. <laughs> I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say, hey, with an elbow. <laughs> oh no, he's lying. <laughs> you know, oh my God, look at you, sinful, you sinful child, <laughs> and walk away. Okay, Michelle K. He just reaches out next to you and he Donald Trumps her. It's not worse. I hope she slapped the crap out on first. Just, just, I'm going to say, yeah. What if she don't? What if she ain't Yeah, she, it, she when she lying. turns around and she looks at you and says, girl, don't worry about it. It happens to me all the time. Oh, she's Like, she says it to you. She's like, that's why I wear these pants. I already know, girl. Don't worry. Can we go don't home? Worry. Can I go home with y'all? Yep. She's poly. Like, what if she's all witty? Yeah, she's like, uh, no, no. Nah. <laughs> That's what you gotta do, you see? No. Nah. Like, I don't know. If he grabbing her, she already knew it's out. But it, he doesn't have to go for the temptation. Just because it's there, he don't have to right. indulge in it. Right. So that would be my thing, like. But what What if he what just goes, do? grabs it, and, and then just sniffs it? Uh, uh, outside of Jordan. I'm slap him in. I don't even put my hands on nobody. <laughs> <laughs> You did that, and I'm telling you, he had to go to jail. If she don't say such a harassment, I'm calling the police on somebody. I'd be too mad to go home. I couldn't even talk to you. What? What could you possibly say to me? Like, to convince yeah, me yeah. that totally you normal. Be okay. It's alright. Don't worry about it. She it won't happen again. He like, he, totally there's, 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 you're right. There's no control sure for real. That's what it was. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I so, that scent was familiar to me. I just wanted to make sure that's what that was. I'm good. I'm I confirmed it now. I'm straight. Okay, well you will have that. So you keep sniffing on it. Because I won't be there. So no. Or even worse, he does that sniffs it and then acts like nothing happened. He just grabs it and just keeps on walking like nah, And then looks up, he's like, Ben, you wanna sit right here? Like like nothing happened. Like you you really gonna act like you ain't doing what you just did? Oh no, nah, over worse, he'd be like this is this the fragrance I was telling you about. I smell it. I can't, I can't, I you see, I knew I smelled it out here. Smell this. You smell that? Yeah. What's that Japanese blossom from Victoria's Secret? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, last one. <laughs> I can't anymore. <laughs> okay. Supposedly, the man that was on the phone with her. Supposedly, the man that was on the phone with her. Supposedly, the man that was on the phone with her. Supposedly, the that was on the phone with starts yelling how they hate a certain ethnic group while amongst said group. A bullshit? A bullshit? A bullshit. Oh, I'm definitely leaving. You're on your own. I ain't fucked up. I'm like, what? <laughs> Check, please. Say, say y'all in the Mexican restaurant. She's like, man, I can't stand damn Mexicans. 
started losing them. You should have said that before we went there. You should have said that after we after we got the food. That's it. <laughs> but don't say it while we still sitting here. All these people looking at us. <laughs> no. I'm definitely. Yeah, no, I can't questions. fight everybody in the building. I'm not doing no. that. What what if it's a uh, a not a, a a pleasant group like actual Indians? Not not Native Americans. The dot Indians. They don't fight. They talk shit, but they don't fight. They can. You seen them Indian Bollywood movies? Maybe they need yeah, you seen them too. <laughs> oh my god, this just turned very, very racist. <laughs> we done took a real racist left on this. This is not where it was intended to go. I'm out of here. I ain't doing nothing. Nah. <laughs> Yeah, they're gonna come in your face and you're gonna hear the background sound. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> no. I was afraid of that. I'm not, I'm not touching that. I'm I knew somebody was gonna go Punjabi on it, dog. No. <laughs> I knew somebody. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I love that song too. Yeah. No. Yes. <laughs> I like Indian people. <laughs> I like it. I love everybody. It was just a joke. So everybody's just gonna run out yep. if their significant other starts yelling uh basic ethnic hate stuff while they're around that ethnic yep. group. Yep, you just Kanye yourself and I'm I'm exit stage left. Okay. What if what if they're around a bunch of Africans? Definitely oh fuck out. that. They, they, they I'm, were I'm not. Skinny, bro. Hell yeah. Well, I, I understand heavy duty cutie because he can't really pass on that one. But the rest of us can kind of pass on if we keep our mouth shut. Nah, maybe you can't dodge no dart. I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> Please, accurate. Please. I'm so racist. They don't have fucking darts like that. I'm so racist. I cannot believe this shit. <laughs> You talking about you talking about, about the dudes with like the gold gold rings and the necks is mad long. Oh, hey, I don't care. I'm nah. Yo, it's all types of average. No, Cliff talk about the damn the Congo ones. The damn. Nah, this is Americanized. They got the short muzzle on their shit. They short, it's a little bit shorter. It's just, it's just pocket size. They pull it out. They, they pull out like a vape, like a vape. You know, you know the hand. You think the niggas are rolling dice? They're like, they go that fat nigga right there. <laughs> From the Wachanti tribe. <laughs> that nigga be sitting there like Jim Carrey talking about it's in the bowl. <laughs> oh my god. That's it. I'm done. Okay. <laughs> hey, alright, so what if it's a bunch of Somalis? Come on. Y'all, y'all scared of Somalis? Yeah. Yo, they got it's big just, eyeballs. That's the everything. It, it's just No, nah, they got big foreheads, man. They got them big Ted dancing foreheads, dog. I don't know. Like that big. They like that big, though. Yeah, but their eyeballs are big, bro. They see in front and behind you, bro. Nah, I don't trust that shit. Mm-mm. Y'all niggas about to get protested. I'm just I'm just fishing for the racism at this point, dog. I'm, I'm just digging for it. I'm just digging for it. I, I I, I really want to bring it out of everybody. I got no, I got no, two no, and no, two. No. I need I need Michelle K to, no, to pop it on. No, I'm not doing it. I don't need to be checking my tires when I get up in the morning. All right, All right what so if what, what if your man disses you and embarrass your weed man, saying this shit is shit. That's your favorite weed. Ooh, man. are you going to defend your man or the weed guy? First of all, do he smoke? Yeah, because that's how he know is is bullshit. And he's like, yo, you don't need to get it from him no more. This shit is trash. And he, and and he don't have no replacement. Oh, no. What? Yeah, yeah. First of all, you you're not supplying me nothing. But <laughs> 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 
he's he's breaking the he's breaking the barriers with the D. Well, you, you can't break that barrier and find me no weed, man. So no, you can't. If you can't find a backup plan, it's better than what I have. I'm good. He's two and a quarter inch killer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let me go, baby. <laughs> two point two five. Two point two five inch. <laughs> That nigga's a chihuahua with Great Dane energy. <laughs> he think he's swaying, but you like, oh, boom, boom. Yeah. You don't even got the size of me out here talking like you talking. Mm -hmm. no. Oh my God. Okay. All right. Last what? one. What if, what if, um, what if y'all are in a group around a bunch of Special Olympics people? I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> And I already know where this is going to go, so let me go. <laughs> I'm not getting it. Crucify me, Lord! Crucify me. By himself. He's going out by himself. This is, this is Canadian CD Travels, and I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> I am you know, not. Know. Well, um, what are you doing? <laughs> no. Mm -mm. Oh, I will jump on that sword all by myself. Okay. All right, we're going to wrap it up. <laughs> Anybody else got anything else? No. We could. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. Oh my God. That one hurt. Ladies and gentlemen. Oh my God. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Especially comment, because we definitely enjoy reading the comments and we respond back, you know, almost as fast as you write them in. So please do that because that helps us out. And, and comedian CJ. They always respond back from them. Damn. I need a sarcastic button here. That's a, that's a low blow. I got you. Wait a minute. It's been a minute. I'm going to get back up. Yeah. See, when I was on it, y'all didn't, didn't even pay no attention. I did. You sure? CB did it. CB did it. Do it. All right, well. Yeah. <laughs> so, with that in mind, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to get ready to get up out of here. I've been King Bear in the building. Come here and see that Charles. Okay. I don't know what you heard about me. Didn't even need it, but I had to do it. <laughs> the one and only heavy <laughs> Nah, nigga, you gotta, you gotta get the quarter inch killer down, nigga. You gotta change the name. The one and only quarter inch killer. <laughs> no, he didn't. He didn't. Oh my Look at gosh, that. you are so. And we're going to see y'all on the next one. Y'all have a great time. Nope, we're stopping right now. Peace.